Welcome back to Contractor Corner. I'm Gary Parker alongside Walt C. from our Blucher brand in the Watts family. We're going to learn a little bit about Blucher today, but Walt, more importantly than that, we're focusing on how this benefits a contractor and why they see something new and different, and sometimes they'll tend to shy away from it. We're going to change that narrative today. The whole concept is taking it from the drain, whether it's a shower channel, floor drain, trench, and connecting everything through to where it hits the main line and out of the building. So everything is a push fit from a fitting, um, connecting right to the outlet from your P-traps, your, your tailpiece to P-trap, and connecting as one complete system where it's all push fit design. You know, one of the big, big things from a contractor is they haven't used it before. Yeah. So that's, that's kind it's of getting over that hurdle. Right? It's, it's a yeah. new product, right? Yep. Um, but simply what it is, is it's a spigot and hub design. Mm -hmm. You have a gasket that's a compression based. So you're popping this in, you use a joint lubricant, which is a water soap alcohol mix. So you spray on a little lubricant. Put yep. the lubricant right on the spigot end, push fit through with a little twist back and forth motion. So you're kind of getting that, that lubricant through the, the gasket okay. and around it. That's simple. In. You know, it's this simple with all the different pipe lengths. All the way up to 12 inch diameter. One and a half. You know, 12 inch gets a little, little harder than this, sure. but not by much, sure. right? Um, so you can connect it just with one, one person, connection right through. And once it dries, then it locks into the 7 PSI pressure okay. rating. You know, for, uh, depending on the size pipe, obviously the bigger pipe, uh, the PSI goes down, but sits and holds. So that's the key from a, a, a non-pressurized pipe system or waste drainage system, um, being able to lock through and following the flow pattern of the waste. So there's nothing that's hanging up. You know, the, the key is in the socket, the... Uh, the spigot end goes past the gasket, so you're going to have to either have a, a, a backup in the system to be able to get any waste going into that, that gasket. So the, I follow. The other key is you're not making any direct contact with the connection piece or the gasket. So from a degradation standpoint, it gives it more longevity. Mm -hmm. You know, Blucher's yet to have, uh, we brought out the gasket system, I think, in the early 1980s. Uh, we've yet to have a failure on a gasket or a degradation of gasket. So there's a domino effect there where not only are you saving time because that assembles so quickly, your labor is going to be reduced on a job site too. Exactly. Okay. Even just from a scheduling standpoint yeah. where you have less labor, um, you're doing a, a job in terms of you know, 60 connections and where it, it literally takes seconds uh, in connecting, right? Yep. Uh, compared to butt weld where you're six joints an hour uh, for a skilled welder saving a lot of time on the job and in a lot of the, the potential scheduling. So you're in and out faster. We see a lot from a food production uh, expansion in their facilities where they mm -hmm. need to get in and out. Very want, quickly. You know, right. Each day of production that they're, they're losing is critical and losing hundreds of thousands of dollars, right? So, so. That's, that's a great point too. So if you have a, a mission critical building, right, or you need to get in and there's only a set amount of hours to get something done, this is gonna give you a better chance at getting that done quicker than say a traditional method. Exactly. Wow. And that's where we also have just, you know, miles of pipe in stock in the U.S. Mm -hmm. uh, Spindle, North Carolina, Sparks, Nevada, um, and custom design and making our own trench in Fort Worth, Texas. You know, that's a pain point for a lot of people these days, too, is uh, supply chain issues, right? And so being able to service them in various parts of, of uh, the USA, that's very helpful.